Hello everyone, today we'll be discussing how to make rexus during phaco emulsification cataract surgery. This is one of the most important steps of surgery. You can first you need to fix the globe. You can either use a rexus forceps through the main wound or you can use a cystitome made up of 26 gauge needle through the side port. What I usually prefer is a cystitome. I enter through the side port because it gives good anterior chamber stability. Once you have entered, make a nick or a scratch on the entry capsule and lift up the flap. Once you have lifted up the flap, drag the flap in anti-clockwise direction. You can use any direction you want, it's up to your convenience. So once you have started dragging, uh, make it at around circular 5 to 5.5 mm size. Do not make a large size rexus. Small size rexus can always be enlarged. Remember if there's a large rexus, that will cause a lot of idle un instability. Be slow and steady, take your time, do not be in a hurry. If this step goes wrong, then you're gonna have a very tough time throughout your surgery. The force should always be forwards and inward direction. Drag the flap in a way that you want the rexus to be. Be slow, be calm, take your time and the beginners can always use a chocolate wrapper or a grip peel to learn the step and uh, one should always master the step before starting a phaco surgery. So here are a few important points. First point is the force should be forwards and inwards direction and you should take your time. The second important part is the size should always be 5 to 5.5 millimeters. It should be a well-centered and circular axis. So I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.